During the week, Carrytown, with its wide variety of stores, attracts bumper-to-bumper -bumper traffic. On Sundays, the area is less populated with potential customers, even though shopping on the day of rest has been legal in the city for almost three months. And while there's fewer customers about, there are also fewer shop owners around. You're likely to find more stores closed than open, making window shopping a common pastime. But for those shop owners that run business as usual on Sunday, there are no regrets for working seven days a week. Richmond having a lot of college students, it gives them another day to work. And uh, we use Sundays not only for, you know, the sales, but for also restocking and cleaning and just the maintaining of the store that we don't get done during the week. It's not real booming, but I'd say it does compare to a regular weekday. And a lot of people can come in and um, pick things up that they haven't been able to get other days. They might have made a purchase earlier in the week that they want to come get. So it's a convenience? Yes, I'd say that was the, is the main advantage to it. It's not a big book day. It's magazines and newspapers usually. Is it worth it to have Sunday hours? Yes, it is. It okay. has been. Uh, it gives people an opportunity to shop when they wouldn't normally have. Store owners have found one more benefit to Sunday shopping. The weekday hustle and bustle is absent, allowing customers to leisurely get acquainted with products. So when they're in a rush to make a purchase, they know exactly where to go. Marguerite Pardone, WTVR News 6, Richmond.